Good morning. Wake up, Baltimore. I'm Max McGee. 8.55 a.m., 36 degrees. Getting a check with the weather with Meg McNamara. Yes, happy for Purple Friday. Yes, we Friday. are ready for the weekend. We're ready, ready for the Ravens game. I will say there is a chance for rain there on Sunday, so we could see some of those showers during game time today. Partly to mostly sunny skies, temperatures in the mid 50s. You'll notice, though, thanks to a cold front that moves through, we'll be down into the 40s over the weekend. Max. We have a school closure to pass along for you. James McHenry Elementary Middle School in Baltimore City is closed today due to a power outage. A scary story out of Hartford County. A bank teller has been arrested for a violent home invasion. Mike Shu has the story. Good morning. Police say that the teen knew that the victim had withdrawn a large amount of money from the bank because the teen worked at the victim's bank. Police arrested 19 year old Nathan Newell after they say he broke into the Bel Air home of a 78 year old bank customer, robbed and assaulted him and another person home at the time. Newell is being held without bail. I'm Mike Shue reporting for WJZ. A 36 year old man is under arrest after a police pursuit ended in a crash. Officers noticed a stolen car along West Baltimore Street. The pursuit ended at Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard and Saratoga Street. Police say not only was the car stolen, but the tags on the car were stolen as well. More news, weather and traffic today at noon.